Donald Trump's campaign has proposed pushing back the final two presidential debates with Joe Biden by one week. Earlier, the U.S. president said he would refuse to take part in a virtual debate on 15 October that organizers were planning in response to his coronavirus diagnosis. In a statement, Trump campaign manager Bill Stepien suggested that in-person debates should be held on 22 and 29 October instead. Please use Chrome browser for a more accessible video player no movement of dates for Biden he added, as President Trump said, a virtual debate is a non-starter and would clearly be a gift to Biden because he would be relying on his teleprompter from his basement bunker. Voters should have the opportunity to directly question Biden's 47-year failed record of leadership. Advertisement, subscribe to Divided States on Apple Podcasts, Google Podcasts, Spotify, and Spreaker but Joe Biden's campaign said Mr. Trump doesn't make the debate schedule and he should stick to it. More from US Trump's erratic behavior does not allow him to rewrite the calendar, and pick new dates of his choosing, his communications director Kate Bedingfield said. We look forward to participating in the final debate, scheduled for the 22nd of October, which already is tied for the latest debate date in 40 years. Donald Trump can show up, or he can decline again. That's his choice. Please use Chrome browser for a more accessible video player. Trump won't waste time on virtual debate. The Commission on Presidential Debates, a nonpartisan committee that has organized all presidential debates since 1988, had proposed altering the second TV clash between the Republican and Democrat candidates. It was originally meant to be a town hall style event, with the two men facing questions drawn half from a group of undecided voters in the hall itself and the rest from social media. Please use Chrome browser for a more accessible video player highlights from Pence vs. Harris debate but the organizers said the debate should be moved online instead to protect the health and safety of all involved, given Mr. Trump got his positive coronavirus test seven days ago, last Thursday evening. In that time, the US president has been in and out of the hospital. Vice President Mike Pence and Mr. Biden's running mate Kamala Harris also faced off in a TV debate last night, but were separated by clear plastic screens. Let's block ads. Why? Show your love for him. Click the link in description. Thanks for watching.